Gamers.net. What's up, everybody? This is Derek B, and I'm making this video just to let you guys know that uh, I'm going to be making a weekly video series for thesickness.net. It's one of the West Coast's biggest um, hip hop websites, and um, I need some questions. So give me some, uh, give me some questions. I'm going to do like a Q and A every week um, based on your questions. So um, this all is pertaining to the independent music business. So send me your questions, shoot them to me, follow me on Facebook, Derek Bergerson. Uh, my YouTube channel is The Independent Music Seminar. I just made the channel. There's not many videos up there yet. I got exclusive interviews coming from producers, from engineers, from entrepreneurs, everyone involved in successful campaigns regarding independent music. So go ahead and hit me with a question. You got something you need help with, shoot it to me. And uh, I'll make a video about it. So anyways, uh, follow me and I'll talk to you soon. How do you know if you have any fans? I'll have the answer coming up next. What's up everybody? This is Derek B. And you're watching the Independent Music Seminar where we cover every single major topic concerning releasing an independent album. On today's show, I'm going to be giving you my definition of what a fan is. In my experience in the music business, in order to be profitable, you have to know your numbers. And I know a lot of you have been in the business for a long time, and you probably are masters of your craft. But one thing you have failed to do is to learn your numbers. Please don't be offended. This method might make you feel like you're just starting out in business. But if you don't know your numbers, then it's a good chance that you are starting from scratch main number I want you to focus on is how many fans do you have so here's my definition of a fan in the music business anybody who's willing to spend fifty dollars or more on you or your brand throughout 12 months that's someone I consider a fan all right now add up all the money you made last year from music and that's including CD sales shows features merchandise t-shirts whatever you did add it all up and divide it by 50. Now, this will give you a close indicator on how many real fanatics you have. Remember, fans is short for fanatics, so fanatics are not regular people. Back to the numbers. If you made about $10,000 last year, then you have around 200 fans. Knowing your numbers is about profits, it's about losses, it's about time you spend on your craft, it's about how much you put into it. These are numbers, you know, they're all indicators of what your success level was going to be based on how much you put in. Numbers is time and numbers is money. Don't get hung up emotionally about the number you come up with. If you feel like that number is a little bit low to you, then relax, let me explain. There are tons of people who enjoy your music and probably lots of them who play your stuff religiously every day. But if they don't exchange any money with you, then I don't consider them a fan. You know, in my book, they, they're just not a fan yet. And the fan list, it comes and goes. You add some, you take some away. Everyone has different things happening in their life. And so they're not always fans all the time. I think there needs to be an exchange of money to indicate whether you're a fan or not. So if you love the music, that's great keep loving the music but if you're a fan a fanatic you'll go to the shows you'll buy the merchandise you'll follow them on every platform you can on social media and it just continues don't throw that word fan around very loosely reserve that for people who really really are into you and they will show that by exchanging money with you question of the day here we go do you agree with my system of calculating fans or do you have your own system uh, let me know in the comment section below, and if this video was helpful to you, please like, share, and subscribe. All right, I want to thank my video sponsor, TheSickness.net, your number one source for rap music. Also, go sign up for my newsletter at my website, www.independentmusicseminar.com, and thanks for watching.